did not have all of our bones from the original whale. We had a full humerus and then we had a radius and an ulna on the left side of the whale that were mostly complete. However, they were sawed off in the harvesting process. And so we've re-extended those using a water putty, which takes quite a long time to dry, but is very moldable and very sturdy. We have all of our finger bones printed and painted by our very wonderful artists. So they look quite convincing. And they've all been drilled from either side all the way through the bone so that they can kind of be threaded on to threads like the beads of a necklace. And from there, they were bent into graceful shapes so they don't look super straight and surprised hands. Uh, and then they are fitted into our bones, which are also drilled so that they sit correctly at nice angles and will be very sturdy. And our bones are also fitted together with a much thicker all thread again for that kind of stability and they have a lot less bend than a human arm they don't really have that same elbow joint but they have a lot more flexibility in their fingers their carpals metacarpals so it's a very similar process to our vertebrae actually where after they were threaded onto their wire it's just layers and layers of silicone over multiple days, letting it dry in between and trying to make it look as nice and smooth as possible. Uh, we do the silicone in layers so that it has time to dry in between because if you do a really, really thick layer all at once, it won't dry very quickly. It will dry eventually, but it will take a very long time and is more likely to sag and get into a shape that you don't want it to be. I've been with the museum as a volunteer for two years and I've been hired as an employee since October of 2020, which has been a very nice job to have during the pandemic, getting to work mostly by myself until working on this whale project, which has been really a dream for me because it's where art and science meet and that's really why I love museum work in general is because it's really seeing the beauty in nature and preserving it for everybody for decades to come.